Now that our work is all bound off, we're going to add our buttons. For this, you're going to need a yarn needle with yarn that is either the same color or a similar color to one of the yarns you used in your work. This yarn is threaded through the needle so that it's doubled and then just tied in a knot at the end. You'll also need two buttons. I chose clear ones. You can choose whatever color you think will work best with your work. To determine where the buttons are going to go, simply fold your work over, see where the buttonholes line up. I'm just going to stick my needle through right there so I can remember where the needle needs to be just about. I'm going to move mine up just a little bit and then pull it through. The knot stops it really well in the back. And then I'll put my button onto my needle. Now you're just going to go down into the other hole. And because this yarn is so thick, that actually holds the button really securely. So we're just going to turn it over to the back side and tie it off. There. Now you can grab your scissors and cut off the excess yarn or you can weave in the ends whichever way you want. Either way will work just fine. And then grab your other button and repeat the process.